So my question is, uh, what's the biggest difference between this year's competition and what you did last year? Uh, we have a lot of differences. The first one is we have two courses, so we have two teams that can go in parallel. Uh, the second one is this year, there's a series of military obstacles, uh, such as the gates and navigation buoys. But after that, we've got four optional stations. Last year, everything was actually in sequence and was mandatory to be completed. Uh, by having four, mandatory, four optional stations, that give a lot of uh, freedom to each team to decide which obstacle they're going to go for. And each of those obstacles is much more, complete, uh, much more complex than what we had last year. Okay. And what... Uh... What difficult hurdles are you already planning for next year? <laughs> uh, that's a surprise. We're definitely going to see some recurring teams. Uh, good chances that the amphibious uh, operation or uh, automated landing uh, task is going to be back. Uh, and then uh, we're talking with the judges and the industry to see what they're looking for for the rest. Okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Uh, we, are, we are off target. We are going to miss the, uh, the kind of ball and maybe hit the shoreline to grab off. Oh, that's not good. Oh, honey. Grab it. Grab it. Get that